YouTube this is about to be a quick video on how to take creases out of your Jordans first of all I want to mention this trick only works on shoes that are leather like the fire red fours or the military blue fours um, my fire red fours I did the trick on last night and you can see no creases on them they look uh, DS pretty much and uh, my military blues you can see a crease right across here I'll put it closer up to the camera I'm about to show you guys how to iron that out to keep your J's looking fresh. Okay, so your first step is, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a magic eraser marker dip in a little bit of water and then just clean off any excess dirt on the shoe because we don't when we use the trick to iron out the creases we don't want any of that dirt getting stuck in the creases and ironing into our shoes so I'm just going to clean them up like this and just dry them off and then we'll be ready to start the process okay so after you clean off all the excess dirt on your shoe you're going to want to take a sock or a shoe tree or anything like that. And you're going to want to shove it deep into your shoe. Shove it just like this. Then you'll be ready to iron it. You want to make the form that you want your shoe to be ironed into. Alright. So after that, just take any kind of t-shirt, a blank white t-shirt, cotton, anything. It doesn't matter. You're going to want to put it over the part of your shoe that you will be ironing to take out all the creases. After that, a nice little neat trick. Take a cup of water, pour it on your shoe. That way, the shirt forms to the body of your shoe. It's going to form to the toe box and it's going to be easier to iron and see what you're doing so you can take out the creases more effectively. Just pour a little bit on there. It weighs down the shirt to the shoe. All right, now we're ready to start ironing. Okay, what you're gonna to wanna to do now is heat up your iron to the highest possible setting, which on a standard iron is cotton or linen. So now that we've done that, we're gonna pour a little more water, make sure the shoe's soaking wet and the t-shirt is formed to the body of the shoe. We're going to put the iron on here. Don't be afraid to use any force. We want the steam to happen. We want the leather to heat up and form to the shoe tree that we have inside of here. Then we're going to start ironing it just as if it was a work shirt or anything like that. Forming it to how we want it to look. What you're going to want to do this is just iron it in there. Take it off. Put just a little more water on there, keep it straight, wet, warm to the shoe, and keep repeating this process for, I don't know, about five minutes or so, depending on the severity of the crease you have in your shoes. You're going to want to crease them out. I would just recommend doing this. I do it like once out of every two weeks, maybe. And after I do it, after you guys do it, you're going to want to run to Foot Locker or Foot Action or somewhere in the mall like that. And actually grab a crease protector because that's what I use. So you put that in your shoe, then you won't even need this trick because you won't get any creases in your shoes. I try and get them in all of my new shoes because it's just an amazing thing to have in there. You can run, jump, do whatever you want in your shoes and you won't get any creases usually. Yeah. But don't be afraid to just like really hammer this iron in on there to get these creases out. And also, you want to use a trick, put it on the side to get out these side creases where they kind of bend towards your foot. Just iron it in there. Okay, so once you've ironed out the creases, your results should look like this. As you can see, no creases in the shoe. They're looking like these right here, the fire reds that I did the day before. It's a test run. We got out most of those really nasty creases and you have an overall good shape on your shoe form. 
yeah, so this trick, it works very well if you ask me. And like I said, you're just going to want to go to Foot Locker Foot Action and get a crease protector and stick in your shoe. It's like $9.99. And that's the best way because pay $160 for these shoes if you get them retail. So you're going to want to keep them nice and fresh. So like I said, more videos coming up. Try this on your shoes. If you like it, subscribe and I'll be sending more videos soon.